Good morning, live in the Fox 21 Morning Newsroom. Check this out. Get your syringes. <laughs> We're cooking. All right, more on molecular gastronomy with Chef Daniel Bartlett coming up this hour. Trust me, some cool stuff on the way you don't want to miss. Hang on. You're watching Fox 21 Morning News. Hey, molecular gastronomy. That's the art, the science of preparing food. Of course, you eat with your eyes. This is Chef Daniel Bartlett on the way. Get this, Foxy Mobs. Happy hour has begun. <laughs> Edible screwdrivers. It's coming up next. Hang on. <laughs> you seen Kimberly? All right, well... Uh, I'll just go on by myself. Uh, stimulating your senses of visual to taste and everything in between. Craig Coffey this morning, molecular gastronomy. Have you seen Kimberly anywhere, uh, Craig? Hey, the search is over. Good news. Of course, we're talking, uh, uh, you know, alcohol. She's right here. Oh, there she is. Cocktails. Woo. I got it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. We're, it's no box wine. We're making edible screwdrivers. <laughs> That's your stuff, right? Not box. No. Okay. All right. Let, let, let Chef Daniel do his thing. Okay, very cool. All right, this is uh, Chef Daniel Bartlett. Now, we're talking molecular gastronomy, right? Yep, exactly. Okay, so uh, edible screwdrivers. Right. Okay. So, uh, for me, when I think molecular gastronomy, I want to have fun with my food. So, how can I play with the senses? So, instead of drinking it, you're now eating it. It's a different experience. Okay. And it'll still get you drunk. But... <laughs> If you don't want to add alcohol to these, you don't have to. That's the cool thing. So um, cool. I okay. want to I want to surprise you, Craig. All right, are you ready for this? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> now look at that. So this is a neat little technique that I was do. that a little molecular joke going on right there? Yeah, it was. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So the process is you're just using gelatin, or you could use agar, and agar is derived from seaweed. You could find it at Whole Foods. It's okay. a natural gelatin, so it's uh, animal free. Um, but what you do is you mix it with your product. So orange juice and vodka right and so I have three different styles here which I'm going to show you how to play okay all right and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these microgreens and this of course takes preparation so that's yes. why they're already made for us right exactly morning. okay and how long does this take to make um you know really the mixture is pretty easy to make it's just a matter of time for the gelatin to set up okay now what is this you're putting on there uh, these are microgreens so okay. mature or in, uh, mature immature herbs so they're picked at a really young age okay okay now do you you still eat those with the uh, yeah. with the screwdriver? Uh huh. Okay, and that those tastes the, go it, well together. They do, and it's really just a, a garnish. So I'm not putting too much on these okay. guys, but as you can see, I'm going to touch these ones up really quick. Okay. And then we're going to throw these ones since this is an actual glass. We're just going to play, place it sure. right there. That in looks the amazing, by the way. We have blueberries. That looks so cool. Okay. Oh, thank you. Thank yeah. you. We have blueberries coming up. Okay. And when you would garnish for your plate, you could just kind of put these blueberries around. Okay. Um, however the way you want. If you just want to go, oh, oops. And you know, okay, great. It works. It works. Right? All right. Okay. And lastly, you want to add some more zest, some greenery to it. So we're going to take this microplane. Yeah. And we're just going to zest over some lime juice. It's going to put a little bit of juice on. The or, microplane. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to put a little zest on it, and then it's going to hit it with a little bit of juice as well. So just a little Very extra nice. detail. But Well, you can really smell that. Yeah. That's yeah. actually me. That <laughs> smells really good. You, you smell <laughs> delicious, Chef so, Daniel. Anyone told you that before? Uh, I don't mm, know. Ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Yummy, right here. Okay, so that's it right there. This looks amazing. Edible screwdrivers. Edible screwdrivers. You layered this there, the orange juice and the vodka. Mm -hmm. uh, again, it's a gelatin. Now, his website's on the screen. There it is. It's chefdanielbartlett.com. That's chefdanielbartlett.com. You teach as well. So go to the website, check it out. It's called Molecular Gastronomy. 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 Molecular <laughs> gastronomy. It's the art, the science of preparing food and making food fun. Here, enjoy your edible cocktail. I, I don't want to eat this. It looks too good. We're going to go ahead and toss it back to the studio. Kimberly, I'll save this one for you, okay? You better. I had to go back there and check it out. I know. It was, you were like a little cat like, slipping around. It was like there was kitty litter it was somewhere It's really cool. There, All right, so. yeah, bring that. We should have it on the desk here. Yeah, I want to get a gonna... closer look at that molecular <laughs> gastronomy. All right, Craig, thanks, thanks so much. That's right. Food becomes fun now. Molecular gastronomy. Check this out. Chef Daniel Bartlett on the way. Three words. Says it all. Ice ball cocktail. Oh, yeah. It's getting good. That's coming up next. Hang on.
unique science of cooking with a presentation that turns a meal into a work of art. I was just running from around the weather office and I'm excited now because Chef Daniel Bartlett is here this morning showing us the craft of molecular gastronomy with our own Craig Coffey. Good morning, gentlemen. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Hey, that's right. Molecular gastronomy. My test results are in, and I'm good. Ten years. Woo! Yeah, another ten years. I'm safe. Clear okay. right up. No, serious though. Thanks a lot. Yeah, we're here in the newsroom, uh, just down the hall. Come back. It's a party. This is <laughs> Chef Daniel Bartlett. Good morning to you. Good morning. And tell us what exactly is molecular gastronomy. Okay, so molecular gastronomy is the science behind cooking. How to properly cook an egg, or working with food chemicals to make gels, foams. Um, anything to really play with flavors, colors, and textures. Okay. So that's what we're doing today. Okay, very cool. Okay. And, you know, they say that uh, flavor is half the, uh, half the presentation. <laughs> Absolutely. Right. I agree. Yeah, okay. So uh, now we're doing ice ball cocktails. Ice balls, right? Yeah, okay. So this one's really cool. Um, I started out with this, okay? And I would just uh, use a whiskey or a rum, and I would just pour that in there. And okay. you can see it's just a hollow or a solid ice ball. Okay. So I was like, how cool would it be if I could suspend the cocktail in there? Actually inside the ice ball. Uh, yeah, exactly. So you can kind of see the cocktail suspended in there. Right. And look at this. And we, Chambord, right? Oh, yeah. We have Chambord. I feel so sophisticated now, <laughs> Chef Daniel. And like Mike said, the faux talk here, it just got real. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. So I use okay. a, a syringe to uh, put in the Chambord so it stays sure. nice and neat. And this whole molecular gastronomy, this is not just the science. It's also, it's kind of the, uh, the art of food preparation and oh, presentation. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Where, uh, where, yeah, food becomes fun, and uh, <laughs> you're almost afraid to eat the food because it looks so good afterwards. Right. You put that stuff in. Can I just break one of these real quick? Yeah, just absolutely. One? Which the, one? This one right here should be good, or this one right here. So those ones are completely hollow inside, and okay. they're going to crack just like an egg. And this one may take a little bit of time because okay. you can see they are thick. The thicker, yeah. the okay. harder it is to okay. crack. Okay, so now we have, that is our garnish. Our garnish is actually going to be on the bottom. Bottom. Okay. And if we cross our fingers and we drop this in, it doesn't break. Very nice. So you can see if you look down that the cocktail is suspended over the berries into the ice, right? And then how do you get your cocktail? You actually use that hammer and you actually have to crack it. Am I going to break the glass? Uh, just be very careful. <laughs> and this is actually a great cocktail. If you're at a bar, it's a great way to break the ice with the lady. Oh, uh, hey! So That's right. It becomes interactive. You're now involved with your drink rather than just drinking it. It's a new experience Very for cool. individuals. Now, if I need a pickaxe, yeah, there you go. For the cocktail party, um, um, you know it's a good time. All right, absolutely. can you show us how you fill one? Yeah. Um. Okay. So it's. I just have these molds. I don't have one of the molds with me. But okay. You just fill it with water and yeah. you agitate it. And okay. as it freezes, um, it's still liquidy inside because okay. water freezes from the outside in. Right. And before it completes. Uh, a full solid ball, you just drain the liquid out. Okay, by so, the way, he has a cookbook due out on the 18th, right? November 18th, Very it's cool. on my and website. This drink kind of inspired that cookbook. Exactly, I won an international competition and now it's getting published in the cookbook. Very nice, it's so, just in time <laughs> for the holidays. Okay, his website, by the way, it's on your screen right now. It's chefdanielbartlett.com. That's chefdanielbartlett.com. More on the way. Coming up next, we've got, uh, oh, this is. You could say caprice, caprice. or caprese. Yep. <laughs> yeah, okay. A unique twist on that delicious dish. Next, back to you guys in studio. Watch, Cheers. Watch it with that hammer. Yeah, Man. easy, easy, buddy, with that thing. Look at that. Hey, let's go party. I got a hammer. <laughs> okay. He's We're getting hammer. hammered. He's getting hammered. Hammer. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. We thought of the same. <laughs> That's so funny. Craig and I think yeah. together. I like how you have to work for your cocktail. Yeah, yeah. You got to break, break it open. No, you just I don't like to work for my food <laughs> or my drinks. Thank you, guys.